For Valentine's Day we're going to make a pretty scarf but it's red and that's why we made a tutorial on how to make this stitch and this is called a moss stitch. See how pretty that is. So what I did is that I did my 32 chains at the beginning and so I have 15 of the single crochets and this is the way it's done. I'll make a row so that you remember you chain two up and turn and now you're going to go in between the two the space between the two single crochets make one single crochet, chain one Go in between the space in between the two single crochets, single crochet, chain one, and I will see you when I finish this row to tell you about the space that we're going to make for the scarf to go into. Red is very difficult to see when you're making a video, but I'll try to be thorough about it. So I am going to count five void spaces. I do 32 inches long, so measure 32 inches long or a little more if you want it longer. So now I am going to count one, two, three, four, and I'm putting as a pen or a marker on the fifth. And now in the center I have one, two, three, four, five spaces. And then on the other side, I have one, two, three, four, five, and that's where I put my marker. So let's do this row. We're going to chain two up and turn. Now I'm going to have my single crochet, so, and chain one, that's one. This is the second one, chain. This is the third one, chain. This is the fourth, chain. And this is the fifth. And I need to chain one. So we do our chain one. And then ten more chains for the center part. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now I want to go into where I have my next marker and single crochet and chain one, that's one, and single crochet, chain one, that's two, Single crochet, chain one, that's three. Single crochet, chain one, that's four. And single crochet and chain one, that's five. And I do my two chains up. So now we want to close this. And we're going to do our single crochet on the first one and chain one, that's one, two, three, four, and you're going to go into that first void because you need to make your fifth one in there. So five, and chain one and go into that next chain so we have one two three four five and this will be the first one of the fifth in the middle the five in the middle so that's one chain one skip one Two, chain one and skip one, 
three, chain one, and skip one. Four, chain one, and skip one. And five, chain one, and skip the, and well, that now you have to go into the void in between the two stitches. So the, now you single crochet, chain one, single crochet, that's two, single crochet, that's three, single crochet, that's four, and on the last one, single crochet, and now you have your five. So we have the 15 in total, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. And I'll do my next row so you can see how it looks nice. Okay, next row. I do my two chains up. Single crochet chain one, one, and two, three, four. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen, and I'm back to normal. So I do my two chains up and keep going, and then try your scarf so that this part here goes into the middle, and you have more or less the same amount going this way then you have going that way so I'll take some pictures of this and I'll be back soon after doing that hole there I worked for about about 10 more inches and then that's it what you want to do is cut your yarn leave a good size tail so you can weave the end and instead of doing the two chains up just pass your yarn through and now you can weave in the ends and that's it I will take some pictures of this and thank you very much for watching please share us with your friends and like our page and subscribe and I will see you next time